How to show closing credits using Shotcut. This video is best viewed in full screen mode. Move the frame cursor to the point you want to start showing the credit roll. Then click on the clip to select it and then split the clip. Click on right clip of the newly split clip. Then click on filter. Click on the plus icon and then click on show video filters icon. Scroll down to the overlay HTML filter and select it. Click on the open button. Then navigate to the HTML file folder and select the HTML file. Now let us take a look at the HTML file. You can use the body element tag as is. We have one style element and inside it we have defined the CLS underscore credits class. Feel free to change the opacity, font size and text color as you like. We assign a zero width to the scroll bar so that we do not see the scroll bar but can still scroll. We use jQuery so please include this element. Also ensure that the jQuery file is physically present in the same folder as the a.html file. We add one more script element to write our jQuery code. It's a simple code and all we do in it is to set an interval of 10 milliseconds, increment the global top position variable by 1 during each iteration of the interval and auto scroll to that point. We now come to the element that holds the actual credit roll. You can note that its identifier is credits. It is also assigned the class CLS credits that we defined earlier. Add a number of BR tags so that the names of the credit roll take some time to appear from the bottom of the screen. Add all the names that you want to show in the credit roll ensuring to end each name with a BR tag so that each name appears on a new line. This can easily be done either by using Microsoft Excel or by writing a simple script in Perl or Python. This is the end of the div for the credit roll. As you can see it is inside the body element. Finally let us take a look at how the credits appear. Thanks for watching, please subscribe, share and like. Thank you.